What up, guys? So I'm shifting gears on the channel here. I'm going to jump right into it. Um, something I've been wanting to do for a long time. I've always wanted to laugh and react to things. So, And play a little games here and there. But I want to put all that, like, this is what I want to do. I want to make laughing, like, I want to do trying not to laugh videos. I want to react to funny videos or whatever. Just, I don't care what people think. Whatever. It's just, it's what I want to do. I want to try something new because I actually enjoy doing this. All right? And um, it's just fun. It's something I enjoy doing. And I like to play games. And I will still do some gaming stuff. But maybe one game a month or something like that, depending if there's enough to play through. But mostly, I really like to play old games, too. I want to try doing some of those. So I have to get them working. But, um, yeah, that, that's really it. Um, so before I start with this one now, so George Carlin dubbing Thomas the Tank Engine. Now this one of my, this is my all-time show growing up. Like there's Thomas, and then there's SpongeBob, and then there's everything else. Those are my top two. But I mean, there's SpongeBob, and then there's Thomas. So um, what makes it even funnier? George Carlin, the late comedian. Um, he is hilarious. My favorite comedian, and he did narrate Thomas and. Somebody incorporated some of his comedy bits into his narration for the show. And this is going to be super funny. I know it. I might have seen these a long time ago, but I really don't remember anything. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, I there's multiple video of these. I might do a Try Not to Laugh for another one. We'll see. But for this one, I really am in a mood for laughing. So, um, we're going to see what this one does for me. <laughs> All right. It's only six minutes. Let's do it. Maybe we'll stop feeling cold if we talk about warm things, like sunshine and steam. Or a nice tattoo of Madonna with her hand up your ass, <laughs> muttered Tom. There it is. The bus growled as he gazed at the happy passengers. Miserable pricks, he grumbled. I wouldn't have brought them if I'd known. I'd have had a breakdown or something. Sounds Duck really good, too. At such an idea. You don't like it? Suck my dick. <laughs> <laughs> the conductor, the fireman, and the guard buy tea and cakes from the refreshment like my lady. My dick is a buzz. The refreshment lady was making her way to the train. Bake me a fucking loaf of bread, <laughs> said Peter Sam. <laughs> Couple of corn muffins, jelly donut, I don't give a shit. <laughs> I'm in the market for quality baked goods. <laughs> Bullshit, said Thomas's driver. We've been along here hundreds of times and never had an accident. That makes it worse, the policeman answered. He wrote regular lawbreaker in his book. Thomas puffed sadly away. Fuck that lame ass cop. <laughs> it's a line for everything. The law is the law, he said, and we can't change it. Sir Topham Hatt felt exhausted. No one should ever do anything to help the police <laughs> in any way, he said. I hear tell about an engine and some tar wagons. Shut up, said James. It's not funny. Fuck you. I think it's hilarious. How do you like that, <laughs> said Donald. <laughs> Animals always run if you toot and look them in the eye. Even bulls? How the fuck should I know? What do you think I am, a fucking psychic? <laughs> Hold on. He even has the lady voice for Daisy? That's... F Why does the audio sound so clear? It's like... I don't know. I think he did audiobooks a long time ago, but it's like it sounds so perfect. <laughs> An angry farmer was telling Mavis just what she could do with her train. Get over here and give my dick a couple of jerks. <laughs> Having trouble, Mavis? Chortled Toby. I am surprised. Fuck you, said Mavis. <laughs> I want to be fair, Douglas, but I don't know. Ah, fuck it. I am a splendid engine, answered James, ready for anything. You never see my paint dirty. No one is amused, said Toby innocently. So calm down and knock off the shit. Stop trying to draw attention to yourself. <laughs> James went redder than ever and snorted off. <laughs> now who's an old fuss pot? Laughed Nancy and set to work once more. Holy shit, look at the fucking knobs on her. <laughs> Lick so. my asshole, you dim-witted prick! <laughs> the new engine arrived. <coughs> What's your name? <coughs> Top of hat. I'm so glad I finished drinking that because I would have spit all over my equipment here at my desk and that wouldn't have been good. <laughs> here we go. 
yeah, I would have failed to try not to laugh, so I definitely got to try doing these for the other ones. Ball sniffer. <sighs> but, said the other engines, the rest of us never thanked her properly. Exactly, said Thomas. So now I think we should all give her a special Christmas party. Oh, no. Or get your penis tattooed to resemble a candy cane. <laughs> Great for Christmas blowjobs. So Topham Hat said, one, two, three, push. What a bunch of pussies, <laughs> said Sir Topham Hat. Harold flew lower for a close... Hey, he doesn't even help in the episode. If you watch the actual episode, he's just standing there as everybody's working, so... To inspection. What the fuck is that? Whizzed Harold. Oh, yes. I like children. Oh, no. I like children. A harbor. The seaside. Children. That will be lovely. You have a child fetish, and it's not healthy. I so. knew it. James's driver and fireman could not make him move. At last, the inspector arrived. Show a wheel, James. You can't stay here all day. Fuck you, I'm going home. I'm already motivated, said James. <laughs> Feel help, that. Thomas, help. We're glad to see you, called the children. You show me your wee-wee and I'll show you mine, said Thomas. We'll all be back Again, to work tomorrow. We're glad you've come back. We can keep you in order now. Keep me in order? Fuck that, impudent scallywag. <laughs> Botheration. Fits his that character. means I'll be late. They've cleared the line for you, but there's something worse. Out with it, Toby. I can't wait all evening. I just realized I haven't eaten an ice cream sandwich in 47 oh. years. No, I'm not going to drink. Masturbation is not illegal, replied the conductor. <laughs> but if it were, people would probably take the law into their own hands. And remember, this is Mr. Conductor talking. I know what I'm talking about. Come on, Grandfather, cried uh. the children. Do look at this engine. That's a tram engine, Stephen, said Sir Topham Hatt. May we go in it, Grandfather, please? Would someone please explain to me the supposed appeal of having grandchildren, said Sir <laughs> Topham Hatt. I don't get it. You have a leather bootlace there, said the conductor to a smartly dressed man. Please give it to me. Oh, it is, huh? Well, fuck you. <laughs> then I'm afraid the train will just stop where it is. The passengers all said what a bad railway it was. Then they told the man how bad he was instead. All right, all right, all right. I'll give it a shot. The station master was furious. Get the fuck out of here, he said. <laughs> how so is he going to get out? was enjoying hot porridge for breakfast. Fuck you, you cunt, he said to his wife. <laughs> Keep fucking with me, little dick. The butler came in. Excuse me, sir. You're wanted on Get the... Get the fuck out of my life. <laughs> <laughs> Leslie, the way we're acting is crazy, said Sir Topham Hatt. Let's put all this petty personal stuff behind us and act like professionals. What do you say? Good idea. I agree. Then he set off to catch his train. That was fast. When Henry had got up steam, he puffed out. He was dirty and covered with cobwebs. Oh, I'm stiff. I'm stiff, he groaned. Good. Stay the fuck out of here, said Sir <laughs> Topham Hatt. I'll show them, he thought. They think Gordon is the only engine who can pull coaches. Fuck them. I'll chuff and I'll puff so fitting. and I'll break your door in. Drives me crazy. Close the fucking door, will ya? You're letting out all the cold. Look, here's twenty dollars. Go down to Burger King, why don't you? I'll save that much on electricity. Close the goddamn door. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Um. <laughs> oh, I love that. That's great. I just love how it fit. Everything fits perfectly to like. Had Thomas been an adult show, like a lot of those lines would have fit in those situations if you've actually seen the episodes, uh, like I have a million times growing up. And now that we have the new premise of the channel here, feel free to send me stuff to react to, suggest stuff to react to, try not to laugh, so whatever, anything you want me to do, uh, just comment below, all right? Um, I'll probably make a community post too, asking, um, so you can answer there as well, but... I'm very interested in seeing what you guys would like to see me do. So now that I'm kind of having fun with what I'm doing. <laughs> All right, that was fun. Um, we got another video for you guys tomorrow we're watching. I think it's a YouTube poop. So, um, yeah, so we'll see you guys tomorrow. 
Have a great day. Like, subscribe, turn on notification bell for each and every upload. Um, check out my Twitter and the merch. Links to all those are in the description below. And uh, we'll have some more links up later on. But until then, um, yeah, have a great day, guys. We'll see you. Uh, yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.